In this video, I'll demonstrate how to solve an exponential equation. We have the equation 4 raised to the expression 3x plus 1 equals 8 raised to the expression x minus 5. One of the first things I want you to do is think about the bases on each side of that equation. When we look at 4 and 8, is there a base that they have in common? 4, you might recognize, is 2 squared. So we can rewrite the left side as 2 squared raised to the 3x plus 1. And 8, you might recognize as 2 cubed. So we will rewrite this as 2 cubed raised to the x minus 5. When we apply properties of exponents on each side, recall that when you raise an exponential expression to an exponent, you multiply the exponents. So on the left, we really have 2 raised to the 6x plus 2, after we multiply the 2 times the 3x plus 1. And on the right side, we have 2 raised to the 3x minus 15, after we multiply the 3 times the x minus 5. Now, because of the one-to-one -one property of exponential functions, when we have two expressions that have the same base that are set equal to each other, the only way that can happen is if their exponents are equal. So this tells us that 6x plus 2 is equal to 3x minus 15. Now we just solve this linear equation for x. We can subtract 3x from each side and subtract 2 from each side. This gives us 3x equals negative 17, or x is negative 17 thirds. If you're asked to write this in the solution set notation, that would be in the set brackets negative 17 thirds.